you do that, you exemplify gratitude and what it is and how it works. And when you do that, everyone around you is watching. And for those of you that have children, you are changing your family tree. You're changing your legacy. Because your kids are not going to do what you say. You know that. They're going to do what you do. I remember that time mom and dad paid off that car. And, and, and then the next time they got a paycheck in, they built it up. And they went and bought that lady down the street who was struggling a car. I remember the time my dad did that. He didn't make a big deal about it because he didn't want anybody to know. They thought they might misunderstand, but he just did it because he thought he was supposed to because he had a grateful heart to the Lord. I remember that time. I remember that time. I remember that time. That's what your kids need to be saying. It's a legacy you're building. They're watching you. About three or four weeks ago, I went to East Tennessee where I was born. Merville, Tennessee. That's how we say it from there, Merville. If you're a Yankee, it's Maryville. But um, <laughs> Merville, Tennessee. And uh, while we were there, my wife said, hey, let's go by the graveyard and see your grandpa and granny's grave. And I said, okay. And we got over there, and I couldn't, I couldn't find it. I hadn't been over there in years, and I didn't know where it was. I had to get on the cell phone with my aunt, and she's telling me how to. And I walked, oh, there, okay. And she says, now, I'm standing there talking to her, looking at the grave. And she said, now, if you'll look up to your right, you'll see this big pine tree over there, and that's where the rest of the family's buried. And I said, the rest of the family? Yeah, there's a whole bunch of your relatives. Said, oh, okay. So I went wandering over there. Sure enough, there's her mother. There's, and, and I have this neat thing. It's one of my favorite possessions on the planet. I, when my grandmother died, I was able to get her Bible, which means the world to me. But oddly enough, there was a stack of Bibles there, and I started old ones, you know, old ones. I started looking through them, and I have the memoirs of her, her grandfather, which would, and that's my grandmother, so that makes him my great, great, 